Hello friends welcome to another movie recap video. Today, we are going to talk about romantic drama movie title Everything Everything. It was directed by Stella Meggie. Starring Amanda Stenberry, Nick Robinson, Anna de la Reguera and Anika Noni Rose. 18-year-old Maddie, Amanda Stenberg, is being treated for SCID, an immune disorder that prevents her from leaving her home and interacting with others. Her mother, Pauline Whittier, takes care of her with the help of her nurse Carla, who has taken care of Madeline for 15 years. Pauline monitors her daughter's health status constantly and provides daily medication. Only Pauline, Carla and Carla's daughter, Rosa, are allowed in the home. Pauline does not allow Maddie to leave her house or interact with anyone or anything that has not been sanitized. Maddie yearns to see the world, particularly the ocean. One day, a new family moves next door, and their son, Nick Robinson, who is Maddie's age, catches her eye. They share a look as Maddie watches through the window. Later that night, while Pauline and Maddie are watching a movie, the boy and his sister appear on their doorstep, offering a bundt cake. Pauline politely rejects it, and as she is about to close the door, the boy asks where her daughter is. Pauline lies and tells him Maddie is not home. Although Pauline sees Maddie's desire to get to know the boy, she tries to block off all opportunities for Maddie to contact him. It is also revealed that the father of the boy is violent and their relationship is strained. Later, the boy writes his number on his window for Maddie and soon they begin communicating through text. He introduces himself as Ollie and they text for a while, getting to know each other and eventually growing very fond of each other. Knowing her mother would not approve, Maddie convinces Carla to secretly let Ollie visit her inside the house, though Carla makes them promise to stay on different sides of the room from each other. She later invites Ollie over for the 4th of July, since her mother is working that day. Maddie and Ollie share a passionate kiss as fireworks go off outside. The next day, Maddie notices Ollie fighting with his father outside. When his father shoves him to the ground, Maddie, to the shock of her mother, rushes outside to comfort Ollie. Her mother rushes her back inside. Pauline deduces that Maddie and Ollie have been seeing each other and forbids their relationship. She later fires Carla for betraying her trust. Although Carla is empathetic towards Maddie's circumstances, Pauline will not let her daughter out of her sight. Pauline does not want anything to happen to Maddie, and the only way she knows how is to keep her locked up in their home. Maddie decides that it is time to take matters into her own hands. With a credit card she had previously opened online, Maddie buys two plane tickets to Hawaii and convinces Ollie to travel there with her. In the car on the way to the airport, Ollie calls his sister, Kyra, tells her that he is going to Hawaii with Maddie, and says that it will only be for a couple of days and tells her to take care of their mother. In Hawaii, they share a romantic and life-changing experience together. While they were in Hawaii, Hawaii, Pauline sends a police car to find Maddie, and then she spots Kyra walking by the house. Pauline asks Kyra if she knew anything about her brother and Maddie and where they were, but Kyra says that she doesn't know anything. During the trip, Maddie passes out and Ollie rushes her to the hospital. She wakes up back in her bed at home. She breaks off contact with Ollie due to the fact that she does not want to make another mistake over love again, and is therefore unable to say goodbye when his mother finally decides to leave his father, and takes Ollie and his sister back to New York with her. A doctor from the hospital in Hawaii calls Maddie to give her an update, and tells Maddie that she does not have something as severe as a CID. Maddie scours her mother's records and cannot find anything that indicates that she had ever been diagnosed with the disorder. She realizes that her mother has been lying to her for her whole life and runs away from home. Maddie stays with Carla and Rosa. A doctor confirms that she has never had SCID, just an underdeveloped immune system from underexposure due to living in filtered air her whole life. Her mother later tells her that after Maddie's father and brother died in a car crash, Maddie was all she had left, and she wanted to protect her and keep her safe. Maddie is upset and leaves. Later she reunites with Ollie in New York, where they restart their romance. The movie ending also implies that she and her mother begin to fix their relationship. We will meet you with another interesting movie recap video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. 
Thanks for watching.